Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Terraria. Uh, holy shit, what is happening to my frame rate? I don't know. Um, yeah, today what we're doing is a little bit strange. Uh, we have made these rooms livable, but they're not gonna remain like that. I was looking at ways that I can purify some of this corruption that is now at what percent? 23% crimson, <laughs> which doesn't sound like a lot, but in reality, man, that is so much of our world. That's a fourth of our world. And the way to purify it, like I need a machine that's that I can buy from an NPC that spawns after one of the first mechanical bosses. And I actually have the mechanical eye here, because I think that's like the... That's some of the, the easiest of them all, which, yeah, we are going to summon, but probably not in this episode, unfortunately, because I want to be a little bit more prepared rather than suffer through humiliating losses. Uh, I want to get like a magic weapon first, but, ooh. <laughs> this has simplified the episode a lot. Yeah, I wanted to buy it from this guy, which I thought that we were gonna have to look for, and I was planning an expedition to the dungeon, which we might still do at some point. But yeah, now that we have the wizard, things are a lot simpler because guess what? We have everything needed. And we might find this fight this boss after all in this episode and just see so if I go over to him what does he sell bubble wand plasma lamp fireworks party center a fucking pogo stick mount which is interesting uh, a kite party wagon but most importantly, oh, he doesn't sell the book. Why doesn't he sell the book? No, where is the book, old man? Let's buy the fucking pogo stick at least. Hold on. <laughs> that is so cool. That's it. Wee! What the fucking hell? Wee! So that's. Got like a very big jump to it. I don't know if it's like very fast, but it's certainly interesting. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, he doesn't sell the book for some reason. Let me check why. I mean, it says it's always available. Look at this. Always available. So why the hell does he sell it? Like, oh, there it is. Hmm. Was I talking to someone else earlier? I was talking to a party chick, I think. That's weird. Anyway. Uh, yeah, so he sells it. And I think this bell, like, also does something. This crystal ball, I think, does something. Let's buy the bell as well. And the harp. Fuck it. Alright, so what can we do with the harp and the bell? This is how I <laughs> research things. Souls of Night, Souls of Sight, those are dropped by bosses, Souls of the Sight, and yeah, same for the bell. All right, so we can just use this. Uh, what about the crystal ball? What do we use that for? Uh, we can make stuff from it. And it's we were living in a chore. Decor. All right. Holy shit. Animated background. All right. Whatever. Let's make the thing. Um, where is the crystal ball? There, there it is. We are running out of air in this place. I think I'm gonna start removing some stuff. But for now, this should work. 
So how do we make the Cursed Dome? I don't think it's called the Cursed Dome. Uh, what's it called? The Golden Shower. <laughs> so we need uh, 15 Souls of Night, which I believe I do have. Uh, souls of Light are those, but I also got Night Souls. Cool. So where do we craft them? There it is. Golden Shower. Let's see what we get. Nimbo Golden Shower. <laughs> Yay! And it's just like our old uh, water scepter. Well, I think it should be better than our... Where is it? The Mystic Dagger. Is it? Hard to tell. Hmm... Magical Turning Dagger. I don't know, we can try both of them. Maybe we can try for a better enchantment on that one. Let's see. Ah, uh, nope. Actually, I need you to do the thing. Reforge. Love and go, Jesus Christ. Alright, do it. Damaged. Godly. That's a lot better. Cool. So, we got that now. 45. I think it should be faster than the... I mean, it will allow us to get more distance on the boss, that's for sure. And that alone might be enough. Uh, let me just deposit some of the stuff here. Like, I don't know, the slime trophy will just hang it somewhere. Ah, uh, this freaking harp, man. The harp, the bell. Uh, the souls we put in here, along with the acre. Uh, we found this, by the way, which was interesting. Well, I was doing my thing. Like, it's one of the spider things. It's not better than... Oh, it might be better. Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> I can get as many as I want. Actually, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That is so cool. <laughs> like, we can be like Dr. Octopus. Can travel just with this. <laughs> that is so cool. Alright, anyway, I think we're, I'm gonna stick with that. I don't know if it's better. Let me check. Unfortunately, the range is pretty short on that one, so we are going to be using the double hook. But it's a good find, I like that we have it. Uh, right, let's go to accessories. Let's see what we can find, and let's try and harvest this night, otherwise we're going to have to wait for the next one. Uh, let's use drop them down here as well. Sort items. Cool. Uh, utility, let's put down these planter boxes. Uh, what the hell is that even? Ammo, let's put it there. What else? Mm, let's put these in findables. Uh, try and put these in blocks, we still got some stuff place in here. Right, uh, let's get some potions that we might need. Alright, let's sort things just to see more clearly. Right, we got healing potions, a hundred. I would like to change them for the big ones, these ones, and when they run out, these ones. Or these ones? I don't know. Reduce potion Kuda, this might be better. Uh, immunity to lava, mana regeneration. Sure, let's drink that. Falling speed, invisibility, aura of light. Attackers also take damage. Sure. Archery, hunter, gravitation, mining, heart reach. I guess. Builder. Uh, let's 
Eat one of these. Night vision. Interpretation. Uh, knockback. Alright, I think that should be enough. Right? Shall we drink a gravitation? Let's drink a gravitation as well. Alright. Uh, what also takes some mana potions? Let me just check how do I use them. Uh, J, apparently. Alright. Right, accessories. We definitely want the celestial cuffs, which I have right here. So we're gonna be replacing the. Hmm. What shall I replace? I think I replaced this, unfortunately. I didn't want to, but I don't want to re remove the charm of nets. It's pretty good, actually. Right, where are the accessories? Man, before we run out of night. Uh, to find visibility, invincibility, balloons and whatnot. Reduce mana cost, melee damage. Hmm. Magma, cobalt, flying carpet, jellyfish, head bone. Others. Stuff. All right, I think we should be good enough. Let's try it. Let's like drink all the potions. Are we gonna make her an arena? Hmm. Might make an arena. Yeah, let's make an arena. We don't want to have to redo this shit. I don't know if I'm gonna have enough time. So let's try. Oh, we actually have to make the lanterns. So I may not have enough time at all. Uh, I'll see you when the arena is done. Uh, kinda done. I think that's as big as I'm gonna make it. I don't know if I should, shouldn't should make like a permanent arena somewhere on our base. Cause if we're fighting bosses that's probably where we're gonna fight them, right? But I don't know. Might not be, might not be such a bad idea. Shall we make... Let's put a water cannon down, and a heart lantern, and the starting bottle. And the water candle will have the idea of like spawning enemies that should, in turn, uh, give me hearts when I kill them. So we'll see if that works as intended, but I hope that it does. Alright, I don't think I need that many of these. Like, this should cover me for the most part, and also this. And let's put a war candle here. And then let's put uh, like a couple of candles here and here. And some heart lanterns. One here. One here. One star in the bottle here. And one star in the bottle here. Cool. So it is now 5 a.m. So we've lost the night, unfortunately. But I'm gonna skip ahead until the next night. And we'll fight them hopefully now in the rain, because the rain's kind of annoying as well. So, I'll see you tomorrow. Alright, it is now almost night time, and I want to get started as early as possible, so I can utilize some of the sunlight at least. Um, because I hate, I hate darkness in games, it's like, fucking horrible, you can't see shit. Right, um, let's start by consuming some of these, like, potions. Let's see, uh, let's start with the plum, and then work our way through the other stuff. Like the heart reach, I guess, the mana region, the gravitation, the thorns. Uh, that should be everything, I think. And let's have the golden shower here, as well as the daggers. Uh, we'll get rid of the other server we don't need. One, two, three. And where is the... Not where there is. Alright, we got plenty of bullets. We got this, we got this. We should be okay. 
So, let's get started. Oh my goodness. 43,000, Jesus, fuck me. Hope that is not what I wanted in fact. That kind of works. I don't know which one I should like target. We are definitely doing damage to them. Holy moly, leave me alone. Fucking asshole. I think I have to like... Uh, kill them at the same time. Otherwise it's gonna go bad. At least that's what I remember. 14 seconds until... Yep. Now, this guy is gonna start... Enraging. Maybe I should kill actually one of them because I don't want both of them to be in range. Ooh. Let's see. Maybe I don't need to kill just one of them. I mean, they're twins. I like. Feel the pain when one of them dies, right? Maybe? I don't know. Is almost dead. Oh, I think one of them. No, nope. right. Holy shit, leave me alone, dude. Holy shit, leave me alone. Just 2000 HP left. We got him! Let's go! Holy moly! We dropped 34 gold, Jesus Christ. Oh, did they drop nothing else? Like, no weapons, nothing? Just so upset. I mean, that's okay, I guess. But damn, that was like hard. Uh, hmm. Wonder if the other guy dropped anything. Let's drink another one of these. And see if we can find anything. Don't think he dropped anything. I think you have to like kill both of them to get any type of reward. But yeah, that worked. Pretty happy with that. Uh, can we try again? Is the question. I guess we can try and kill one of them again. Uh, we're still waiting for the steampunk steam bunker to arrive. We might as well try again while we wait. Give me a second to grab the tank. Right, we got it. Um, shall we go again? Guess there's gonna be some stuff on us. Let's just do it. Come on, asshole. I definitely want to get them to have HP before I start like both of them to have HP wish I could attack them both at the same time that will really like be effective like this that's kind of difficult to do with this weapon. I wonder if that's gonna be any better. I mean, it does do more damage, or it's supposed to.
Oh, no, let me go down, please. Hmm. I don't know, I kind of like this better. It's got a wrong, longer range. Oh my goodness. Like, the gravitation thing is, I think, more annoying than it is helpful, if I'm being completely honest. Now they're both in range. I really should have, like, done them one at a time. I think I want to kill this guy first. Oh, they fucking got me! Oh, fuck! That didn't work! So we killed him once, but not twice. That sucks. I mean, we could try again. This time, no fucking gravitation potion, because that shit is annoying as shit, man. It's crazy annoying. Alright, let's try it one more time. Um, let's fucking do it. We are gonna boost ourselves with the other potions if possible. Spelunker... <laughs> I think that's it, actually. Alright, let's fucking try it. Go! I wanna start with the red guy. Because his enraged ability is definitely more annoying. Like, whenever possible, I'll attack both of them, but... I think red guy is gonna be the main focus. Regen a little bit. I don't know what happened to our regeneration. I thought we were regening a lot faster than this, but apparently not. Oh, it's 5. Oh, it's 4.30. Fuck me. Alright, we got him once. That's more than enough. <laughs> I'm gonna be happy with that. I think that was gonna be successful, but fuck. I didn't pay attention to the time. Alrighty. So now we can, like, find this guy, hopefully. Come on, where is he? Why is it taking him so long to arrive? And let's see what we can do with the Soul of Sight. So we can do a bunch of stuff with it, but I think what we're gonna go here is the magic harp because it's nice and easy to craft. I think I have all the materials or I can get them relatively easily. And it's a good weapon. It's my type of weapon. There's like other types, but I don't like summons. I don't like controllable projectiles. I don't like yo-yos and stuff like that. So I think I'm gonna go for that. We got 33, which is pretty good. Uh, I also wanted to see what we can do with the hollow bar. Uh, like we can do the next, like, here of armor and drills and stuff like that. But I have very limited amounts. I think I have 21. <laughs> so I can do just like almost nothing with it. I can do this Excalibur bore out of swing. Could be better than the thing we got on right now. But what else can we do? Light disc? Nope. This optic staff. This Pickaxe X. Pickaxe X, really? Super Star Shooter, hello. That looks interesting. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm gonna go for Excalibur. Uh, where do I do it? Uh, Metro Anvil, cool. So let's do it and see what we get. 
Hello. 79 damage. 79 freaking damage. Wow, that looks super cool. Uh, let's try and re-roll it. Just see what we can get. I think we should get like their stuff. Uh, reforge. Nimble. Nope. Ruthless. Uh, nope. Sharp. It's not bad. Come on, man. Give me something good. Annoying. Weak. Godly. There we freaking go. 90 damage. Damn. <laughs> That's probably really strong. Let's test it out in our little graveyard. Uh, where is my pickaxe? Uh, I don't have a pickaxe, I have this. Uh, it's not what I want, thank you. Yeah, I think we're gonna retire the Mystic Dagger. It served us greatly, but at some point I gotta upgrade. And we'll try and upgrade to the Magic Carp as well, but come on, give me something good. There's the steampunker, we pretty fucking good. I mean, this thing is really strong. I like it. Where is the steampunker? There he is, or she? Ver What's her name? Very. All right, very. What do you sell? Oh, you sell this. It costs two platinum. Two. Two. Platinum. This costs 58 gold. What have you been smoking? All right, we're going to have to figure out how we are going <laughs> to make money. Two platinum, jeez, fuck me. And this green solution is also expensive as shit. Jesus. Alright, so I think what we're gonna do to make money is start like visiting our diamond farm more often. Oh. What happened with our. There it is. Alright. Two platinum, man. You got me like shitting me. All right. Two platinum. Not even kidding me. Well, we're gonna need like three platinum because that shit is like gonna eat a lot of this fucking material. You really wanna go, motherfucker? Right. With two platinum, man. Fucking killing me. Oh, I see why we need to like. Farm gold. <laughs> Two platinum. I'll never believe that shit. I gotta see what's the best way to farm gold. I think, like, fishing is a good way. But, like, I don't know. Let's sell some of these diamonds. Just to see how much we can get from diamond farming. So we got 60 diamonds, which are like two or maybe three yields. And that barely gives us 12 gold. Jesus Christ. Shit is brutal! These souls sell for, sell for a lot, but <laughs> I also have to kill a shit ton of bosses for that. But yeah. We will be doing some farming. We're gonna keep this arena for now. No, it looks like very ugly, but it is what it is. So, until next time.